Magician! Hello, YouTube! The Magician84 here, and welcome to the quarterfinals of the Character vs. Structure Deck Tournament, with only one Structure Deck through. Let's see if you say can avenge Jack as it faces freezing chains. Of course, after this, though, uh, the AI is going to have to use some of my character decks, which will be a cluster fog. <laughs> Scrap Iron Scarecrow. Oh dear. Um, actually, wait, how much will this. Oh, actually, this will be fine. Normal Doppel Warrior. Do oh, for God's sake. I was going to special summon turret warrior and run over one of these guys. No tuners though. <clears throat> right, I'm getting desperate out here. Synchro Shulkan, Formula Synchro. <clears throat> Tuning. Um, yeah, I'll fetch Junk Synchro. So I can at least block an attack from Aqua Spirit. Uh, oh, no, this is going to get really bad real quick. Okay, but will anything get banished, I wonder? Scrap Iron Scarecrow. Hmm, will Debris Dragon help? Summon Junk Synchron effect. Bring back. Nothing ideal to bring back, really. <sighs> Formula Synchron, it'll have to do. And attribute it to Special Turret Warrior. And I have to get rid of Aqua Spirit because that's the threat right now. <sighs> Still not adding any tuners. Why? Genex Undyne and I'll end. 
Oh, that's not good. Actually, I'm not going to use Scrap Iron Scarecrow here, but I will use Skill Successor to finally stop it asking me. And then use Scrap Iron on this. Hey, Shield Wing. Attack. Attack. Set shield wing and end my turn. Oh, great. Now none of my monsters can attack. We are in what we call a pe oh, never mind. Um, why couldn't I use scrambled egg? Wait, I can only activate one spell or trap per turn. Right, you need to. GTFO <laughs> Great Scrap Iron Scarecrow Okay, I need to get rid of General Gantala once and for all. Oh, I should have set one for one. A pointer? All right, go, Speed Warrior. Pesky Warlock. <sighs> Not one Synchro Summon has been done. Just... Uh, why? Oh, there's a tuna, finally. Uh, oh, and uh, it just decided to beat itself. Okay, um, got a handful of tuners. Set everything and end. You're brave. It's not going to get me anywhere. Bright Star Dragon, no effect, so I'll just attack the Fishborg Launcher. Right. Uh, can I live without spells? Hmm, 
No sync reply, huh? Are you kidding me? Well, there's one thing I can do. Chunk Synchron effects bring back Turbo Synchron with nothing to sync her into. That speaker is a pain. Well, at least Bright Star Dragon can't attack or run it over. Oh, hi, Brianak. And Gungna. Um. Yeah, screw it, might as well chain it. Then activate defense draw. Great, another tuning. Uh, this is not going well at all. Oh, I didn't want to lose Scrap Iron Scarecrow. Pop that, oh, that's fine. Go, Speed Warrior. Oh, my God, a Synchron Explorer. This will help. <sighs> back my junk synchron synchro shulken a junk aria then banish the skill successor to boost his points now take down gunga with scrap fist Band. And now I can get some plays moving. Shogun, a junk archer. Let's banish controller for a turn. Then single shogun, Stardust the Dragon. Attack. Attack. Right. It needs to pull something broken out its AI arse, otherwise. Um, this structure deck will be out. Oh, is that it? Oh, that being said, I can't end the game this turn. Oh, now I can. Card Rotator. And attack for exact game. Well, with that, all the structured decks are out of the competition. <laughs> so, yeah, it looks like character decks are better. Um, but we will carry on anyway. You say it's through to the semi finals. Time for Jaden to face Yuma. I'm going to make the AI use Yuma purely because. Um, 
it's the easiest of the two decks to play and I feel like um, it will mess up more with Jaden. It'll probably still mess up, but this is the lesser of two evils. Oh, that's not ideal to open with. Um, well, I might as well try and set up for Shining Flow Wigman if I can. Send the Goblin to Berg. Cowboy? Oh, will this go off in damage step? Oh no, because it's the, the, the Buster that's attacking. So much for trying to science this. But, but how come you didn't proceed with the attack? Hmm. Um. Well, I guess I'll just set up for a miracle contact play. Um. That's annoying. Um, attack. Attack. Sure, he gets to special summon it again, but this was the best I could do. Oh. Oh, crap. Now I have to deal with Excalibur. anymore. <sighs> There's only so much that Grandma can do to keep me in the game, so this will have to do. Elemental Hero Clayman. Oh yes, Magic Cardo, all of us all to bring back Neos. Then play Grand Mall. Attack. Will so much for that. I'll still do this though. Go! Elemental Hero Burst in a tricks. Attack with Flare Storm! left. Now I'll play Elemental Hero Wild Heart and uh, oh yeah forget that Neos can't attack. It's okay. Turn him into a level 6, sure. Well, now I'm gonna have to tribute summon Necro Shade. Ah, looks 
it's like now Utopia is coming out. You. What's the point in equipping them? If. If. If you're just gonna do that. So, yeah, remember Grandma? I wonder. Yep, it's gonna do that instead of draw a new card, which makes no sense. Oh shoot, I've just realised Neos has no attack points. But at least now I can summon my Blade Edge and attack with Slice and Dice. to fetch Bubble Man. Attack for game with Blade Edge and Avian. Making me go first, huh? That's fine with me. Get your game on, Yuma. Hmm. I'll have to end and discard Neos. Well, that stinks. Grave and uh, yeah, take uh, attack God. Why would you do that when you just activated impenetrable attack? You're just wasting cards. And that was questionable. Let me see. Okay, so it only does its effects when it declares an attack. That's fine. Logic card of all of us all to bring back Neos. Then I play Grand Maul and activate Skyscraper. So no need to use Grand Mole's effect. Fine, that doesn't matter. I'm still gonna attack. Oh, um, yeah, I was gonna say I am not bouncing Link Kareem, uh, Rainbow Kareeva, rather, back to his hand. <laughs> I can just bring out Neos Knight. That works too. I was gonna bring out Air Neos, but yeah, this works too. And I'll also bring out my Air Hummingbird. But, oh, right, I forgot. Neos Knight doesn't gain the boost if it's summoned off Miracle Contact. And now V 
these salamanders gonna come back and just ruin my day? Yes, I do. So I can take down Utopia Ray Victory and summon Blade Edge with no tributes and attack Utopia Ray Victory again. Okay, that's fine. I'm still gonna attack Utopia Ray Victory and end my turn. Seriously? This guy, this AI. Well, I have to do it. And that ends my turn. By the way, whoever wins this will face you, say, in the semi finals. I play Elemental Hero Burst in a tricks and attack with Flare Storm. And I'll also play my Aqua Dolphin. Should have selected the other effects. saying oh no <laughs> did the AI brick it's the battle of the weaklings or should I say attack of the weaklings how have you not drawn a level 4 lower And there we go, the reigning character deck champion is gone. And Jaden will face you say in the semi-finals. That's game. Here's the penultimate quarter-final match. We've got Zane taking on Yuya. Um although Yuma uh, Yuya is a favourite. I'm gonna use Zane because I find that uh, the AI keep, makes a lot of stupid mistakes with the Cyber Dragon based decks. Okay, so far so good. confused. Um, not that I can do much with this hand. Well, I can at least take out Arc Pendulum. That's going to be a problem. Well, at least I got rid of a big but Why couldn't I have drawn that one turn sooner? For God's sake.
this, a set of this, just because you never know. Hi, Dark Rebellion. How are you doing? Got a porch here, Mole. Uh oh. Oh dear. Uh, this isn't good. Uh, let's see, will this cancel it out? Not quite. Um, I play Cyberdark Horn, use his effect, equip Hunter Dragon, set this and uh, see what happens and thank you for doing that torrential tribute wait what oh you're joking I didn't know it gave it protection If I'd have known that, I wouldn't have wasted Torrential. God's sake. Well, let's see how this next one goes. Wow, discarding the Duelist Alliance, really. Interesting use of those cards. Special Cyber Dragon. Take him out. Set free and end my turn. Um, pinch helper. Oh, come on, seriously? Well, I'll put Keel on the field anyway, even though there's nothing to equip. Continuing some weenie beatdown of cyberdarks with no dragons to equip. <laughs> oh, God. oh dear. Uh, wait. Oh no, no, it's fine. <laughs>
lovely beast eyes is back, but not for long. Another kill. Oh, let's finish it with Cyber Dragon. Of course, you make me go first. Well, let's go all the way. Future Fusion reveal Cyber End Dragon and send all three Cyber Dragons to the graveyard. Set, set, and end. Game 300. Oh. Right. Summon Proto. Activate Prem. To bring back a Cyber Dragon. Polymerization. Fusing these together to bring forth Cyber Twin Dragon. And get out, explode the dragon. Cyber Twin Dragon, finish this. Damn. <sighs> Sorry, uh, Yuya fans. I actually thought Yuya would beat Zane, but not quite. Zane will go through to the semi finals and face Joey or Yugi. Joey and Yugi, two good friends, duel again. Whoever wins this will face Zane in the semi-finals. Using Skull Dice already? I did not mean to set Monster Reborn. For God's sake, I, I meant to set Zero Gravity. Well, I'm going to add the biggest thing I can add, which is my Gazelle. Now I summon Gazelle, the king of mythical beasts, and... Wow, really? Okay, now I'm gonna set zero gravity and end. Why? But... Was that really necessary? You just wasted that block attack. I call on the winged dragon, guardian of the fortress. Should have brought back the fiend Mega Cyber, what can I say? Well, I'll do it. 
it anyway. A monster reborn to bring back the fiend Mega Cyber. Right, Rocket Warrior's going to be a pain in the arse. What a waste of a grave robber. And you didn't even switch alligator sword to defense. Like, are you serious right now? Play Prem on Sangan, and then sacrifice it along with Marshmallow, the Buster Blader. And Sangan will add Old Vindictive Magician. Dare me, do you? Pot of greed. Oh, it could be fiber jar to be fair. Uh, banish, banish. Bring up BLS and boy of the beginning. Oh no, it wasn't. It's a shame we haven't seen Red Eyes Black Dragon. Really? Swordsman of the... Oh. Well, that could make things difficult. Hmm. Set and end. Uh, oh, well, Jinzo changes everything. Sacrifice Marshmallow for Burfermet. Then use its effect to add Gazelle, the king of mythical beasts, to my hand. Then I'll use Polymerization, fusing Gazelle and Burfamex to bring out Chimera, the flying mythical beast. And I'll attack into Rocket Warrior, since I don't have to worry about Fairy Box. Then Swords of Revealing Light. Oh, he still has to... Oh, crap! I didn't see that coming. Oh, boy. I'll play Magician's Valkyria and end my turn. No! Didn't attack Valkyria, huh? I'll play Breaker, and Breaker breaks that damn fairy box. Then I'll reactivate the swords and end my turn. That's not good. Not gonna do anything. It can't attack. It's a monster reincarnation. Discard Buster Blader to add back the other magician's Valkyria, which I will then normal summon. And now none of my spellcasters can be attacked. will give me some time to find a way to run over Guildford the Lightning. <sighs> and there's no reason.
reason to put anything else on the fit. Oh, well, I suppose I could have put the tricky out. I don't want water to hard draw what upon. Discard for the tricky, and I can at least run over the copycats. Unless, of course, that happens. Set more cards and then my turn. Why? Well, I'll do it anyway. Magic cylinder. dangerous machine. It could be a problem for me. Skill dot magician. Um, maybe I should wait to use graceful charity. Attack axe raider. Oh, oh come on, really? Alright, I've got to play for next turn. It doesn't matter. Zero gravity. Then graceful charity. Discard this and this. Then premature burial to bring back my Buster Blader. And normal summon Sangan while I'm at it. Damn, I can't finish him off. Panther warrior, huh? <sighs> well, let's finish it. And once again, Yugi triumphs over Joey. Disappointing that we didn't get to see Red Eyes Black Dragon, but Yugi will face Zane in the next round. Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to the Dark Magician YouTube channel.